Come on, jump him. Oh my god. That was cool. Welcome that back to the crew too. Today, we have a brand new update. There's a bunch of new cars, a bunch of new customization, and just a bunch of really cool stuff for us to go and give a go. I haven't jumped into it just yet. I wanted to do that today. See, we got it. Have some fun. The Bugatti Devo. If you know the Bugatti Chiron, essentially, imagine a Bugatti Chiron on steroids. That's what the Devo is. And we've also got a new vanity shop with some very cool tire stuff. If you like colorful tires. God damn it. The Elite Bundle. It's 354000 You get the Lamborghini Ego Egoista, an NSX GT3, and a Ferrari 488 Pista. Anyways, that's cool and all, but I was thinking, I want to go give that cheer on a go. How much is it? Oh, that's two mil- Wait, 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 wait. The Devo was 300,000. This, the Elite Bundle, for 350,000. You get three cars from this as well. I cannot believe I'm about to go and drop 66 bucks on goddamn virtual currency for the crew too. Hey, platinum pack. There we go. Now we can afford everything. We now got enough money. I'm 66 bucks poorer. Anyways, I wanted to give this thing a go. So this is a world exclusive for the Bugatti Devo. Before this, it has never, Jesus. I didn't know it had arrow like that. Before this, it has never been in a video game. I love that air brake. That air brake is so sick. Essentially, this is the new Chiron? Not exactly. I mean, so basically the way this works, the way you can think of it is imagine a, let's say a Lamborghini Huracan. The Lamborghini Huracan is the Bugatti Chiron. This would be the equivalent of a Lamborghini Huracan Performante, sort of, kind of. It's built off the same platform, goes through some different sort of bits and bobs to make it a little bit more track focused and makes it a little bit better, quicker, faster overall. I thought we only had four exhausts. Uh, we actually have six. There's two more on the sides that I didn't realize. So it's not quad exhaust. What's, what do you call six exhausts? All right, well, before we get too far into this, I do want to give it a little top speed test just because, I mean, it's a Bugatti and that's sort of what I equate them to, so... Let's come over to the top speed area. I don't know if, whether I should be calling this a Chiron, a Devo. I don't know. It's weird. What's the new Bugatti called? What's the one with like 16 exhausts on the back? We're doing 250 miles an hour. Punch the NOS on. Two, almost 270, 269. We're doing 250 miles an hour. But it's so goddamn stable. It's just like, I don't care. We're fine. Let's go do some customization. I want to see if we can make this thing into a very, very crazy looking car. La Voiture Nick? Wait, is it really called La Voiture Noir? That translates to, from French, the black car. <laughs> vanity, you can purchase vanity items in the HQ. Oh yeah, whoa, these are really expensive. That's 31 grand for neon blue tires and lightning blue smoke is 55 grand. Goodbye, 55,000. Equipped on my- oh, it's already been put on my car, okay. The things I do for videos, okay? I'm doing this so you don't have to. That's what- that's what we're doing. Oh, they're already fitted to the car, okay. So if I go to my vanity items now, I can change my tires. So normal tires versus my fancy neon tires. To be honest, there's not that big of a difference between them. And my tire smoke, we've got normal and uh, other thing which I can't actually see in the garage. Visual modification. So we do have some customization for this. It like gives me a tiny little strip of carbon fiber. Or we can go a little bit of black part. A little bit of black part. I'll take it. How is that five? Mmm. This thing's so expensive. I do want the coolest Bugatti Devo though. A wide body Bugatti Devo. All right. You can't complain with that one. It just adds a tiny little side skirt. How much is that going to cost? Oh. Okay, fine. It brings it out like a tiny, tiny bit. It's not bad. This is gonna be really wide. I like the carbon fiber wing. It looks good. Big boy wing. I think that's the wing we have on the cheer on already though, so I kind of don't want to put that on. Okay, so we can really play around with this. There's like so many different trim options. I really like this thing. It's like, it's, oh, it's so cool. It's like my perfect car. Okay, my, my tires look really cool. I love how I can see the inside of them spinning around. We need to do a burnout. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh, oh my god, okay, that is so worth it. That was the biggest waste of $12, but it's so goddamn worth it. Jesus Christ, I didn't expect it to do that. Oh. <laughs> okay, you, you remember what I said about I'm doing this so you don't need to type of thing? You, you might want to. Oh my god. Okay, we need to go do a race with this. So it is a hypercar, right? So we need to go and find a hypercar race for it. Oh my god. Okay, let's go, Devo. I want to... Okay. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Since when do we have a line above? That's brand new. Oh, I didn't realize that was part of this update. The Devo's all-wheel drive. It's very grippy. I mean, when we get into corners, I'm sure we'll spin up some wheels. I kind of want to put it on a drift car because I have a feeling that if I, if I put this on a drift car, we're just going to be making lightning around the entire drift course. Yeah, I'll, I'll be honest, I didn't think this thing would be that quick against the AI. I was thinking they would have put up a bigger fight. Don't... Okay, that is so goddamn cool. I mean, while we're doing this, we might as well do another top speed test. See if we can actually get 270. Alright, Devo, 250. NOS on. There's 260. 270 down the hill. Turn! Thank you, generous checkpoint. <laughs> We're 18 seconds in front of everybody now. We're doing top speed tests, and meanwhile, we're still pulling away. Safe to say the thing's pretty fast. 250 miles an hour across the line. I feel like with this thing, you don't get a true appreciation for the tires. So I kind of want to go back to the festival. Festival? The... <coughs> the house. It looks like an arcade game car with those wheels and the lightning. <laughs> Fair. Please bear with me. I haven't driven a drift car in this game and I don't know how long. It's literally a Thor car. That's the best way to describe this thing. It just... I... It's the coolest thing. Okay, I'm sure this will be another controversial thing. I'm sure some people will be like, oh, I love that. And I'm sure some people will be like, that's the most unrealistic thing I've ever seen in my life. I hate that. For me personally, I, I feel like it's always good if games don't take themselves super, super seriously. I mean, the crew's an arcade game, right? It should embrace doing things like this, and I'm very happy it does. So, well played, Crew 2 devs, for this one. Jack says, random trivia day. Egotista means selfish. That's why there's only one seat. Wait, are you serious? The Bugatti Devo, awesome, cool, great. We can't not do it. I've literally spent $60 on this. How do you pronounce Egotista? Because I'm, I'm not sure. I know literally nothing about the car, so bear with me. Oh, it's a hyper car as well. Interesting. Okay, wait. This only has 600 horsepower? And it looks like that? I imagine there's no customization. I stand corrected. Yeah, it's not really actually too much customization. I mean, it's just sort of changing trim colors. But I mean, that's still cool. I mean, we go wide body with it. We do have a little rear wing. Okay, let's go see what other vanity parts there are. I cannot believe the amount of money I've spent today. I can get a different type of tire. I mean, we can get like white tires. They're not super expensive. Could be cool. Tire smoke, I think because we've spent so much goddamn money, we need the buck-shaped one. Looks a little interesting. And our bucks tire smoke. All right, what could possibly go wrong? Okay, the, the tinted windows are literally the ugliest thing. I think I've ever seen in my life. It just looks silly. Yeah, I see what you mean by it's only what- Wait, what does the steering wheel look like in this? Are they trying to build a car? Or are they trying to build a-, a Like a- like a jet fighter? Is that- Like, could they not decide? Here, say hello to the Lamborghini. I will shoot you out of the sky. I need- I need- I need- I need a missile. Okay, calm down, Nick. This isn't GTA. Are you sure? Wait, we haven't even seen the tire smoke yet. Stop, 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 stop. I do totally realize we're doing this in the middle of the highway, but don't pay attention. Tire smoke? We need to see the money burn? Oh my god, are you serious? That's my money right there. That's how much money I've spent on today's video. It's all literally just gone up into smoke. I've spent about $20. On all the tire customization we stuff with our two different tire compounds and our two different tire smokes. Or I should say one tire smoke and our fancy tire lightning. And then I spent around another 50 bucks on the two cars. Okay, I, I, I will be honest. I don't like this car. Please don't hate me. 
It's, it's silly, it looks dumb, I don't like it. Single-seater cars, awesome. I feel like they designed this thing to look as futuristic as possible, and in doing so, they made literally one of the ugliest cars I've ever seen in my life. I feel like the heads-up display was designed by my eight-year-old nephew. Somebody's just gone and given him some coloring crayons, and he's gone mad, and this is what he's come up with. Yeah, you know what single-seater car I like a lot? The PLP 50. Guys, it actually doesn't tell me how much money I have left. The, g the game is hiding my own funds for me. So I don't know how poor I am. Jack says these are like 3 million bucks. Well, um, please go to store.ar12gaming.com so at some point in my life I can be able to waste my money on a real Devo instead of wasting 60 bucks on some tires that shoot lightning. However, that's really cool. <laughs> Come on, jump him. Oh my god. That was cool. That was really cool. We're, we dropped places, but that was sick. All right, Ferrari buddy, you got nothing on our 1,500 horsepower. Oh, and a McLaren F1. The, the McLaren F1, for those of you who don't know, has, has three seats in it, as opposed to the Lamborghini Selfish that only has one. So do you think the Devo is worth the money? I would say, I feel like it's very cool. It's got some very cool customization. However, if it was me, I would just buy the tire customization, like the fancy tire, like the lightning smoke that I have now. And that's really about it. The Lamborghini Selfish is kind of ugly. Anyways, there you go. Bugatti Devo, awesome car. Is it worth the price? Maybe. That must look insane. Like, oh, like, okay. It's really dumb. I totally understand how it's so dumb, but it's so sick. It's so goddamn cool.